and the very first time I started doing shows, I started in 2005, and I went to Kandahar, Afghanistan, was my very first show. In my mind, I thought I was going over like Marilyn Monroe in them old USO videos. Remember them? I thought I was going behind the end and waving. And they'd see me on a stage and clap and wave. There she is. I went to Kandahar, Afghanistan in August. Yeah, yeah. And I flew dressed like this. Where the hell did I think I was going? Palm Springs? <laughs> they opened the door to that plane, my hand of the Lord. I went from Marilyn Monroe to Marilyn Manson. Okay, let me tell you. Have y'all been to concerts lately with old people that are older than I am? Okay. Leopard and Journey, and everybody there is our age, and and everybody's worried about the snack bar, first of all, and I was too, and I was so hungry, and I and I noticed that people had big Diet Cokes, like big buckets of Diet Coke, and were <laughs> sucking on those big buckets of Diet Coke while the concert was going on, and every once in a while, somebody would stand up and. And then they sat back down. I thought, isn't it funny how things have changed since I went to concerts when I was 20? Everybody was walking out like this because everybody had inflammation in their feet. I had no choice but to become a comedian because funny follows me. I'm not kidding, it is everywhere I go. My favorite one is when I was working in Indiana. It was just across the Kentucky line off Interstate 65. Right there is where the time zone changes. And I forgot to ask where my show was, if they were on Central Time or Eastern Time. Well, I had to run into Walmart anyway, so I just grabbed a woman in the store and I said, are you on Central Time or Eastern Time? She said, I don't work here. <laughs> 